Hello everybody, it's Neil and I'm back with Ocarina of Time Majora's Mask Randomized. Where are we less let off? Wow 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 Maybe that's left off. I'll bring him in close. Yes. No. Oh, barely hanging on. Come back here. Come over the flower. Come on, I want to pop out and kill you. Yes. Maybe that's left off. We're going to make our way to Woodfall Temple. And we're going to hopefully give our first Majora's Mass Dungeon a little go. And here's the other good news. Oh, we've got the new wave bossing over. Um, don't believe I can do a single thing with that yet. But we need that to get to the Great Bay Temple. And I'll give it my friend over what's worse, Water Temple and Great Bay Temple. They've been replayed them both recently. Definitely Water Temple's worse. I think it's easy to overcomplicate Great Bay Temple. Dungeon map. Well. <laughs> Honestly, you don't need to overcomplicate, it's fine. Oh, I'm not going to make this, am I? Barely. Spit in its face. Very violent noise, isn't it? Rawr. That was naughty of that Deku, wasn't it? Giving a bubble in midair. Forget it, you can just melee them. I'm used, I'm used to them hiding. There is one thing that worries me. Just open that up. One thing that worries me about uh, Majora's Mask and this temple. No, no, no. I want to be Deku. Right. Trying to think what the song was, I don't remember it. Right. No, I'm gonna have to look. <laughs> Something like that. It's like da 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 da. Up left, up left, A, right, A. I wasn't even close, was I? There we go. Um, fairies. So in the Majora's Mask dungeons, there'll be 15 fairies, not just in chests, but dotted all around the place. It makes it right pain in the arse. To get them all. All for potentially one reward. Oh, we got the Majora's Mask Lens of Truth at last. Sure, that'll come in useful at some point. Yeah. 
Qua wa. Um. So normally, very early on in the game, you can get the Great Fairy's Mask. And what the Great Fairy's Mask does is, number one, it tells you if there's a fairy in the room, and number two, any, like, free floating fairy will automatically come towards you. I mean a lot of fairies can only get using that mask. That's the worrying thing. Right, let's open the chest, that's the main thing. Oh my <laughs> Oh Wow. <laughs> I mean, I asked for it. I said I was worried without it. I feel a lot better getting it. And love it. Absolutely love it. Makes me feel a lot better. I mean, the thing is, it's highly unlikely. Yeah, let me just point that out. It's highly unlikely that I'm going to need. Oh, fine. I'm actually going to need the fairies to get an item. That matters because ultimately, it's it's four fairies in the entire game. So it's just it's like the equivalent of opening four chests. It's very likely they're just going to give me crap. But it's what Do you know what I mean? If I'm going into a dungeon, a dungeon, I'd rather be able to beat the dungeon in one fell swoop. I want to clear out the whole thing in one go. So here we go. First Majora's Mask dungeon. Again, because I don't normally, like, I don't play this game. I'm not familiar. Thank goodness I've got the compass. I can live without the map, but the compass will at least tell me where the chests are. So, we're going to put on this fairy mask. As you can see, those fairies will just come towards you. Not those ones, but the stray ones. Also, where's my uh, C button's gone? There we go. That was weird, wasn't it? Can I, uh... Cheat the system a little bit there? <laughs> the image of a stray fairy. Normally they just come out. Oh my god, please. Okay. So if you wear the stray fairy mask, the other useful thing is if you wear a stray fairy mask in a room and there's a fairy in the room, it will emit off particles and the hair will float. So now that um, I've tested it and there's no particles, as you can see, I'm just wearing the mask like normal. I haven't got to worry about finding a fairy. I've done a randomizer where, like, like, there's a fairy in that bubble over there. <laughs> It'd be like an item, like the lens of truth would just be floating around. Oh, right, can I get that through the gap? Sure can. See how the, there's particles emitting now. So. There we go. There's still particles, so there's still more. Fairies. They can be in pots, they can be in chests, they can be in bubbles, they can even be in beehives, I believe. I 
Um, go on, might as well head through here. Um, so if I do this, the plant will try and eat me, but we'll die to Kani Gora. Isn't that amazing? Then I'm going to do this. Ha ha. Okay, got a key. At least I know there's no gold sculptures in this. Um, let's go over to here. Oh no, it's cat crap. See? Just an easy way for me to uh, kill them. Oh well, close enough. That'll do. Treasure. Pizza heart. Oh. Get this. So we can access the upper floor. Oh, we actually go that way. I should just check the room for fairies. Nothing good. Right, but there's fairies in here. If I was a fairy, where would I be? Maybe in that pot. No. Um, where'd the fairy be? I don't feel the ones in here are like. Oh, there's a beehive there. But I noticed the beehive. There we go. I do you like that noise? Right, the particles have stopped, so we don't have to worry about uh, fairies in this room. No, it's an armored Lizalfos. <laughs> that was easy. Two arrows to the face. And that was enough to get it. Skeletula. No fairy, that's good. So let's go back to the main room. This time we'll be on the uh, higher floor. Right, got a nice convenient ladder now. Come back up. That's good. Um, see if we can find more fairies. So we've got stairs there leading to the upper floor. Do I have to activate that one? Or can I just do this? No, I think we have to activate that. Wasn't there like a switch? Switch right there. Um. 
to how I'm gonna jump to that. Maybe I don't need to. Maybe I'm okay. Ah, <laughs> I tried. <laughs> Ah, the sea of fairy. And sometimes enemies have eaten them. Um, um, uh, there's a chest somewhere over there. Oh, the pier. I wonder if I have to press that switch to make the chest appear. Hmm. I mean, I, that is a tree. I wonder if I can just... I wonder if I can just hook shot over. How do you normally get over there? Is there a flower somewhere? There's a flower right there. I can just flower over, can't I? Duh, Neil. Duh. There we go, look how easy that was. There you go, fun fact, uh, Deku links actually to light to activate normal switches. Normal buttons. Oh, we'll get this chest. Another fairy. Oh, we did say I didn't have to worry about fairies. It normally counts ones that are in chests. So that's a little bit worrying. Right, I do remember one thing about this room. Also, don't I just do that? Um, the one thing that I remember about this room is the strafe area that's underneath. Let's very quickly get that. And maybe we just need normal arrows for this. Go. I'm wanking that sculpture just in case it too has a stray fairy in it. Well scouted by me there has to be said. Well I'm gonna go this way. Is it gonna be a uh, froggy? No. I suppose other them might be a Rock boss, mini boss in here, but I might actually have that wrong. Oh god, please, please. I should use more arrows on them than what I did the uh, this Alphos boss earlier. Boss key. Good to have. Don't remember how to beat the boss. Because <laughs> last time I faced it, I had the fierce DT mask. Let's set fire to them. Fairy? No. Oops. Fairy, or the fairy. Oh no, it's a bee. Yeah. Oh, so is this of a fairy? Anyone see another fairy? 
Fairy. If I can hit, let's just go back down here. I mean, it could be something in the water, it could be another beehive. Yeah, they have hidden them. So we can't assume it's in an obvious spot. Other fairy. Ah, oh, there's another beehive there. I figured there'd be another beehive. There we go. I just wasn't sure where it would be, so to speak. That's fine, that's all of them in this area. Again, my C buttons have gone missing. That is uh, problematic, but I'm sure they'll come back. Opportunities here for sticks and nuts. Like a squirrel. Squirrel's paradise there. Oh, it's a room of darkness. a steak. Makeshift torch here. There we go. Right, there is a chest. I was going to say, I imagine it could be Killing all the enemies grants us this chest. Fairy. That's all the fairies out of here. Right. Going to this, no fairies in here. This is like the biggest room in the uh, dungeon as well. gonna hit me. No, oh, I got caught in the tree. Ah, oh. that's annoying. I feel total noobish playing this sometimes. Ah, uh. see what I mean. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Ah, it's getting away. Oh, can I make it? Yes, barely. But it's definitely no fairies. I'm worried if I drop down. Well, it's brought me back to here. Is this 
so many fairies I've got. Yeah, I'm missing four. Obviously, there's still a lot more dungeon. Well, I say a lot more dungeon. There's still some dungeon to go. One room to be besides. But I know there are quite a few fairies in this room, actually. So, I'm not actually worried. So, I believe we'll go this way. So, so two more fairies to get. I've got 69 rupees, I just noticed. That's nice. Another fairy over there. Another one here. So, there we go. We did get a ball. I do think we actually have to go that way, but I'm going to do this anyway because it makes me feel better. Right, let's wait for our fairy to approach me, please. So let's just check our numbers. 15 out of 15. That's good. So we get a reward for getting all those. Um... There's one room we haven't been to. And to be honest, I don't know if to go there now before we go into the boss room or just come back after we've beaten the boss. We'll come back after we've beaten the boss. No, we won't because it's a pain in the ass. We have to go through like quite a few rooms anyway. Well, we'll 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 go and get it now. Well, I believe this is it. I knew there was a frog bot in here. Can I um use this on him? It's cat crap. I forgot about cat crap. Right, it's giving us arrows for a reason. Makes a question if I can hit him with arrows like when he's on the wall, why can't I hit him with arrows when he's on Capra? Narrowly missed. Just think when you're playing this game like normal, vanilla, you have to manually select your Deku mask and all that. What a pain! Here we go. I mean, speaking of manually selecting masks, I think we did actually work out, didn't we? That um, there's no point in us doing this because the the frogs just come back when you reset the time. But we did it all for twenty bucks. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Right, I'll get back to the boss room. Right. Let's 
Let's get rid of these guys again. Oh, I feel I can narrowly get onto that ledge. No. <laughs> Total waste of uh, time and effort that was. Right, I don't need those rupees. Oh, we've got the fairies. That's important. So now what I need... ...is to just beat this boss. Right, I'm going to get rid of these guys. Oh, please. It'd be a benefit for me to do this. I don't remember how he's supposed to actually deal with this puzzle. No, it doesn't feel like it, does it? Oh, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. That's going to catch fire again in a sec. amazing when you play this like as a kid in the 90s the early 2000s you just get through this like it's no problem don't have that same level of memory anymore Definitely gonna make it to that flower. Ah, why can't I remember how to do this puzzle? Right, I'm gonna try this route. Route. And then when the uh, switch reactivates. Oh, there's not a flower up here. Oh. What am I missing? I honestly don't know what I'm missing. Also, I'm getting rid of uh, that sculpture there. How have I forgotten how this room works? My goodness me. Can I barely get onto that? Yeah, I can. Oh, that's okay. Alright, we're fine. We're good. Right, it's boss time. Our first Majora's Mask boss. A very weird boss, isn't it, really? But I guess that, that's uh, this game in general, isn't it? I remember how to take him on because, as I say, every time I've took him on recently. It's been with the fierce TT mask. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't do anything. There's bomb flowers around. Oh, take my great fairy sword. Dealing massive damage. Oh, little insect. Quick, just hit him. Go and nut him. Come here, I'm going to nut all over you. Yeah. That was easy. <laughs> right, what's my reward? It's going to be fun to see. Okay, so we got the Ocarina of Time for in Ocarina of Time, which I'll just point out now is actually completely useless because it it just hand, it just works the same as the Fairy Ocarina. It's, it's one of those. It's nice to have, but it actually does nothing. Look what I have right here, by the way. Got the real Ocarina of Time. How about that? So, like, when I beat the game, I'm sad that it's over. I can play the song of time. <laughs> and reset time and play it all over again. But more importantly... Oh, I didn't know I'd get a song. Cool. Got the Goron Lullaby and the Forest Medallion. So what's that mean? Goron Lullaby. We can do, go and do the next dungeon. We can go and do the next dungeon. I'm pretty sure in its entirety. What else can we do with the Lullaby? I don't think there's anything else. I mean, there probably will be. There'll be something, but I just don't know what it is. So we go. There's the Deku Princess. Who are you? See, she's nicer than um, the Zora Princess, Ruto. Oh, she mad. She mad. I don't know if we actually get something for doing this, but we're going to do it anyway. <laughs> yeah, don't ask. Just accept that what happens. <laughs> So yeah, I mean, once again, we've now got options now. I mean, for a start, oh, fairies, right before we forget. <laughs> we got to go and cash the fairies in. So. We can do Snowhead. If we can find the Zora Mass somewhere, then we can do Great Bay and Stone Tower. But we can do the next Majora's Mass Dungeon. We could go to the Ice Cave in um, Ocarina of Time and clear that out. That will get us another song. Which is tempting to have. Let's 
So it's between those two. Ice Cavern doesn't lead to a, an end game item, no medallion or remains or, or gemstone. Right, cashed in and we got a piece of heart. <laughs> Better than rupees, I suppose. Oh, I don't want to do. I don't want to do Ice Cavern or Snowhead. I don't know. I'm trying to think. I mean... Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. I lost, I lost focus and concentration. That was weird. Guess we're going the long way around. Um, it's song versus remains, isn't it? I mean, knowing me, I'll get the song of storms, and then I'll be like, right, we need to do bottom of the well next. <laughs> and we just keep delaying the inevitable. I mean, this cave's easy. There is that. Just have a few items in. Can get a few sculptures. Um, Snowhead, I don't know how many items it actually has. I don't know. Actually, we need to go to, um, we need to go this way. We can do the Deku Butler stuff. Oh, come on. His head was above water. Thank you. At least you acknowledged that I was a screw-up. So at least if we do this, we can do the Deku but the mini games. Kind of like this game's version of the Dampe challenge. Okay, just do it anywhere. There we go. This is quite a funny cutscene, to be fair. Is that legit the funniest cutscene in Zelda history? I think it's hilarious, the look. Like, you complained about Nintendo 64 graphics in 2023, but that conveyed a look that you know full well that she was furious. She would have killed those Dekus if they didn't release the monkey. Right, do I actually get an item? No, the reward is the, uh, the Deku Butler stuff. Okay, we're going to do Deku Butler next then. And we're going to do that in the next video. So, there you go. It's another dungeon down. And we've got more options. Um, thanks to the Goron Lullaby. So, that's exciting. Um, leave a like. Leave a comment. Subscribe to the video. Not to the video, but to me. Subscribe to me to watch videos. Or subscribe to the videos to watch more of me. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.